Hi everyone, Combat Review Reviewer here, this time reviewing Sonic the Hedgehog Annual 2022. Now, I've picked up the latest Sonic the Hedgehog Annual, and much like I did Beast Wars and other annual stories, I'm going to be doing one story at a time. And the story that I am going to be covering is the first one, Guardians, which mainly deals with Blaze taking on things from her home world, and the story starts off with Blaze taking down a pirate ship saying, Bring us in close, Malene. I'll handle the rest. And of course, takes down the pirate robots, and turns out from that Blaze learns that they were all that's left, and after the events of Sonic Adventure Rush, with Captain Risk Whiskers and his fleet now gone, the everything is now been resolved, and that he's won. And we see Marlene saying, Ahoy! Do you need a hand? What are you in, Blaze? And of course, we see now that Blaze has now realised there's nothing left, and doesn't really know what else to do. And we see Marlene saying, We won! Everything's fair to dingin! Now, and you of all people have earned some time off! Marlene, I'm the Imperial Princess of an Empire! And guardian of the Sword Emeralds. Either of those duties alone carries tremendous responsibilities. And I have both. He doesn't mind you can't relax. If you don't listen to me, who can convince you? And we see how Blaze now realises that she needs to kind of find answers. And goes to Sonic's world with Knuckles, who's meant to be the guardian of the Master Emeralds on Angel Island. And we see how Blaze shows up, saying, May I have a moment of your time? I saw a strange pillar of flames out this way. <laughs> I take it that was you. Yes, the Sword Emeralds allow me to cross over to your world. They are not suitable in their use. Right, what do you want? And he wants to ask him about his responsibilities, and how he manages to balance his day-to-day -day life guarding the Master Emerald. <laughs> And even asking about what he does during his free time. And we see Knuckles saying, You're a princess, right? You got royal duties and such. Occasionally, my mistresses handle the bulk of a... I mostly review their paperwork. The Empire has been so peaceful and prosperous. And keep in mind that after with Eggman N and everything else, peace has now been restored. And we kind of see how he points out about the Soul Emeralds, and has the advice about putting them somewhere deeper, and more secure in the palace, and doubling the guards. And we see how Knuckles points out that Blaze needs a vacation, and points out that he needs time to relax and that, and even points out that even Knuckles himself needs time to take a break from things. And we see him saying, it was nice being around everyone again, after the events or with the early issues. And we see him saying, thank you for your insight, it means a great deal to me. Huh, <laughs> my pleasure. It's nice to talk to someone who understands responsibilities for once. And we see how Blaze offers to kind of guard the Master Emerald for Knuckles, and I'm saying, oh no, you don't, you don't know working vacations for you, besides. I don't like leaving my burdens at other people's feet either. Very well, then if you'll excuse me, I have preparations to make. And goes back to her home world, where she decides to take some time off, and has the Master Emeralds stored somewhere more safer. And of course, we kind of see how Marlene is given the responsibilities, keep in mind that she's this universe version of Tails, and promises to kind of use to use, use the signal in case they ever need plays. And I'm saying, more pleasure, your harness. <laughs> now get out of here. And we see her making her way to, to Sonic's world. And we see how Amy brings up the events of the forest fire. And even Blaze and the other, Blaze shows up with Cream and the others happy to see her. And her saying, nothing dire. I'm just taking a vacation. I don't know, that sounds like an occasion to celebrate to me. Pull up a chair. 
cool and welcome back. Thank you, everyone. It's good to be back. And this is the story. I think here it definitely works. Because after the events of Sonic Adventure Rush and presumably other games that I haven't really played, it showed you Blaze was able to do what Sonic couldn't, was able to bring peace. And I think it's an interesting story showing you that the yeah, Blaze's responsibilities have been done and wants to try to take a break from the action. So I think this one definitely deserves a thumbs up. Still good and still alright. So, Comic Reviewer here, signing out.